guys and welcome back. Um, yeah, so I finished off the concepts um, last night and I uh, posted up again on um, Tumblr and Facebook. Um, so same character, nothing changed there, but the uh, the sword has been added and I just dropped in the goofy backgrounds. Um, but um, yeah, um, so we've got the sword, sword there. So it was pretty, pretty similar to the one I did in the um, the drawing. I added a few things here and there. Um, but now we're going to move over to ZBrush, and so this is the the model I have of the sword, and we're just going to sort of flesh it out a little bit. Um, so, I do have symmetry turned on, I do want this to look the same on both sides, because it, it will be a, uh, a game model after all. Try and get that to, to a point. Uh, yeah, so um, the concept's what I've been working on um, yesterday, um, and today I've been prepping for t tonight. Yeah, this is going up late, it's about 2 o'clock. Um, but that, that's, that's not too bad. So, um, sorry, just a insect or something flying around. Yeah, so, um, working on, we'll be working on this for a while. Um, and in the meantime, I'll be doing the, uh, the armor behind this, the scenes, as it were. Whoop. Try and make this look more like a a blade than some polygons. So. Yeah, so my day, um, I did a bit of modeling for this, obviously, um, and uh, yeah, not really much else. Just um, had a more relaxed day, as it were, today. Um, been playing some. Uh, put some on Monster Hunter, got frustrated with one of the monsters. Um, it's uh, like a big bird sort of thing, and it calls other large creatures to help it, which is, it's actually really, really hard. Um, so I don't know how high I have to crank this for it to keep it sh Yeah, so that was frustrating, but uh, where's Come on.
that's what I was saying. Ah, uh, yeah, the the bird fight was frustrating. Um, but I did manage to do it in the end. Just had to make some a different sword, a uh, different weapon rather, not sword. Um, uh, not that it it might be interesting to to others, but um, the uh, what do you call it? When they release the new Pokemon game, they um, in Japan they bought out like a short four episode. Um, anime to go along that covers the story of the first game, so Red and Blue. Um, and they're bringing out the episodes now with English voice actors. Um, but they've only bought two of the four, so only half of them so far. But if you're interested, they're up on, uh, I think it's Pokemon.tv, the official anime site for for Pokemon. Um, so I've been watching that. That's pretty cool. It's a good it's a it's a cool idea, I guess. Um, but it would have been better if they could have done it yeah. you know, not not made it as short and done a better job. Um, but for what it is um, it's yeah, it's good. Don't know what I'm gonna make this out of. In the concept, it's bone. Um, but I'm really just sort of changing the shape, just trying to make it look a little more natural at the moment. Oh, excuse me. Um, yeah, so, like I said, pretty relaxed day, but ultimately just wanted to get this, this out so I could start working on it. Um, and I will be sticking to um, no pre-rendered stuff. Um, for this, because it's going to take time to make the armor, so hopefully I can like do that while I'm making this, and then once that's done, um, then because that'll be larger, I might be able to do pre-recorded stuff for that. Um, I think I'll leave it there, um, so hopefully you've had a good Wednesday, and I will talk to you again tomorrow. Alright, cheers guys.